Hi, I'm Reverend Tom Kearns and welcome to 333 Magic 9, your astrology channel. Now I'm here in front of the roller coaster at Rye Beach because July is going to start off with a Cancer vibration, but then Saturn's going to change direction, Jupiter's going to go into Leo, and that's going to create a lot of excitement. Now here's what that means for you. The new moon is in Cancer. Sagittarius, the beginning of the month, is influenced by the energy of the Cancer New Moon in your eighth house of rebirth and sensuality. <laughs> this may be a wonderful time to join your energy with someone special in a business or an intimate relationship. Your sensitivity is running on a high level, and so are your emotions. So maintain clarity because decisions made now may bring long-term powerful changes. Jupiter enters Leo. Sagittarius, Jupiter enters Leo and your ninth house on July 17th. Now Jupiter is king of the gods and Leo is the sign of the king or the queen. So this can be the beginning of a 12-year cycle of expansion. This transit is ripe for opportunities of all kinds. Jupiter rules this house and your sign, so his ability to expand is increased. <laughs> Study, travel, and open your mind to new ideas, not old dogmas. The truest opportunity is your ability to see your own future and pursue it. Before going on to the rest of the month's predictions, here's an idea that can help you for an entire year. You can order a personalized transit chart for the next 12 months, or a psychic and spiritual reading by phone. Just go to my website, professorastrology.com, and be prepared for 2014. Saturn goes direct in Scorpio on July 20th. Sagittarius, Saturn moves direct in Scorpio in your 12th house of spirituality and limitations. Now this can bring some constructive changes to the inner nature of your being. This energy has brought you face to face with some of your fears and your weaknesses. Once identified, you can harness the power of your unconscious processes of your mind to become an ally rather than an enemy. If you will open yourself to spiritual practices such as yoga, meditation, and prayer, you will gain a great wealth of freedom. Now these predictions were just based on your general sun sign. If you'd like to get more accurate information based on your time, date, and place of birth, then go to my website, professorastrology.com, and go to the Psychic and Spiritual Readings page. There you'll find a way to order a transit chart that's based on your time, date, and place of birth. So it's personalized for you for the next 12 months. You can also call for a Psychic and Spiritual Reading. Now I'd like to thank you for watching. I'd like to thank you for listening. Please share these with your friends because these videos are free and they can help. So please, thank you for watching, thank you for listening, and have a great summer.